Hi, I'm John Turner, one of the pastors here at NCC. This past Sunday, Scott Curtis's message was titled, Motivate One Another. One of the points he made comes from Hebrews 10, 24. Let us think of ways to motivate one another to acts of love and good works. This begs the question, what motivates you to service or acts of love and good works? For me, I think maybe I have a, a serve DNA. I, I think it was the example set by my parents and even my grandma Turner. We didn't just go to church each Sunday. My parents were active in the church. Dad was there for just about every men's work party. He helped build the church. He would take my brother and me to father and son retreats. He was active in the Youth for Christ for years. I remember one time they had a fun run fundraiser. His wheel bound friend Bob had collected a number of pledges and then talked my dad into pushing him around the track. Mom taught Sunday school, led the junior high youth group for years, even before I was old enough to attend and would volunteer on youth retreats. Grandma was driving old ladies at her church to their medical appointments who were younger than she was. So what's your response to verse 24? Listen to it again. Let us think of ways to motivate one another to acts of love and good works. Spend some time this week thinking of ways you'd like to serve. Do you like working with young kids? Get in touch with one of our Quest Kids leaders. Middle school or high school? Talk to someone in student ministries. Service to shut-ins? Sunday mornings? You may even have an idea we haven't considered. So many times we think of services in the church as happening on Sunday morning or Thursday night in our building. Perhaps there's another need in your neighborhood. Last year, our staff read through the book, The Externally Focused Quest, Becoming the Best Church for the Community. When we were done, I was thinking we could have written the book. I'm excited that NCC has been and strives to be the best church for the community, and it takes all of us. Once again, think of ways to motivate one another to serve.